time. The year's first double murder has been recorded as a soldier killed a mother and daughter in Point Kumana on Tuesday. The victims have been identified as 43-year-old Kalida Shamba and 66-year-old Carmelita De Leon. According to police reports, at around 11.15 a.m., a member of the Trinidad and Tobago Defense Force entered their home at Riverside Drive, Glencoe, and shot Shamba and De Leon. Both women died at the scene. The suspect was charged last December and granted bail for a breach of a protection order and assaulting Shamba. He is currently still at large. A shooting in Port of Spain on Tuesday has left a teenager dead and another man injured. According to police reports, at around midnight, officers were on mobile patrol when they responded to a report of a shooting at Carlos Street, Woodbrook. Upon arrival, they observed 30-year-old Tyron Best and 19-year-old Tanisha Jackie in a silver Hyundai Elantra nursing gunshot wounds. Both victims were rushed to the hospital where Jackie eventually succumbed to her injuries. 12 9mm and 18 5.56 spent shells were found at the scene. After five days in captivity, businesswoman Anisha Narayan Voodoo has been found alive. According to police reports, Narayan Voodoo was reunited with her family on Tuesday. She was then taken to a medical institution where she was examined and is said to be unharmed and in good health. She is currently being interviewed by members of the anti-kidnapping squad. Police also confirmed that no ransom was paid. Investigations continue.